So here we have another clip from our Fastlane 2021 prediction. So why don't you check out the Rebellious Noise channel for more content like this, or you can go over to the Rebellious Noise Pro Wrestling channel where you'll still find all of your wrestling content, including predictions in full, other review shows and interviews. Apollo's just now got this new push off this, um, like this leader kind of, you know, following, and I, I'm actually enjoying it. I'm, I'm not a fan of the voice, but mm. you know that's a sm- uh, that will grow on me. Um, I, I just hope it's not one of the things where he has the voice and loses the voice again. Yeah, I think I think it's um, like the Lana one where it's like you can kind of lay it off because you know she's got that kind of heritage and stuff, mm-hmm. but then eventually she dropped it. The Kofi one was like yeah. just completely fake. Obviously, he has no ties to yeah. <laughs> Ghanaian. Um, but at least, you know, Apollo's got Nigerian roots where his parents are yeah. from Nigeria, you know? So obviously he would have grown up with the accent. He would know how to do the accent. So it's not even a bad accent. It's like you say, it's that eventually he's probably going to lose it. They're probably going to make him yeah. drop it. So it doesn't make sense. It should have been a little bit, I think, more subtle, I think. Um, yeah. Um, also uh, a representative of Nigeria in the uh, World Cup video. That means oh, that we did last year. Sure. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad uh, that- Watch that for you know what I'm gonna really go on that gimmick now. <laughs> <laughs> but other other than the, the small criticism of the voice, as you said, it's not even the fact that he's doing it. It's mm. the, as you said, it's the fact that he's gonna he's do gonna it and probably it. lose it. Yeah, eventually. Um, you know, so that irritates me. But I'm really liking this new kind of evil side of him. The gimmick has that level of controversy that the, that they could exploit if they wanted to. Mm. And I mean, um. You know, with obviously Black Panther two due for release, and like I think it's next year or something. Like it's, you know, it's and it's a Marvel property anyway, so it's it's very, it, it, it's it's very current in a weird mm. way. Like when uh, Birchall was a pri- pirate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, the thing is, Birchall was a pirate. Well, Birchall was a pirate. I don't know if he had heritage in uh, <laughs> with his family <laughs> of piracy, but maybe he did. Um, but the thing is, even that though came, you know. Sadly, the you know the the first two pirates movies were much better than the, what came afterwards, mm. and it had kind of died down a bit by the time Birch was doing his gimmick. But literally, that you know Black Panther two, you know, is going to be a big film. Could obviously you know Chad Boseman passed from that, so it's mm. it is very very current. Um, and I think that I don't know if they're going to they would switch it straight back to Big E straight away. Um, but I have to say the actually title pitch on SmackDown like it could be quite stacked if they let it. And they no, need it for a two-day mania. You need a... Mm. No, it's, this is the time to elevate a secondary title. <laughs> <laughs>